This table features a typical German Christmas feast and was prepared by Gunter Poiss, a native of the Berlin area and owner of the Versailles in Uptown New Williams. This time his culinary roots are featured in a typical main course, roast goose and red cabbage. Chef Preuss quarters and cores the red cabbage, which is then sliced and marinated in the refrigerator overnight. We put it in a bowl here. Take all the brownish or not the too good looking leaves off. So you got, again, take the core out and throw all this out. They also, when, when they teach you how to cook cabbage, they say seven different spices go into the red cabbage. The red cabbage, if you do it in Germany, you marinate overnight. So what you do, you take the cabbage on an angle and just slice it. So all what you do then Here are the ingredients for the cabbage marinade. Just mix it very well, like this, and the cabbage, for some reason, will create a little bit of, of moisture by, by itself. And just put all this in here now, put a towel on, and I guess put into the ice box. For the 10 pound goose, Chef Preuss seasons inside with salt and white pepper, and then stuffs here, with two peeled and cored apples and an onion. What I have here is some, is some fresh rosemary. It's available locally or it's available anyway. Just put a few rosemary twigs and if you don't have it fresh, use the, uh, the dry one. Put one apple in the front and just stick it all the way in there. Put an onion. And you can use smaller. Ours is a little big, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut the onion down a little bit. I have a hard time putting it in here. Put this, put another apple in. And the legs are tied with string, like and the outside is seasoned with salt. String, make a double, double knot on it, and pull this thing close here, OK? Go again. And close this baby up here. You don't even have to make that. Now, the goose is a very fatty fowl, you can call. So what you do with the goose, you don't put grease or fat in here. You just put some, some water in. Before the goose goes in again, put some salt on, on top of it, rub it down. Some pepper, use the white pepper, you can use the black pepper, doesn't matter that much. And that's the goose going in. Roast at 400 degrees until the goose begins to brown. Then lower the heat to 350 degrees for three hours, basting frequently. After two hours, cover the breast with foil. The marinated red cabbage is now started with one sliced peeled apple and a sliced onion. Put the apples in. Like I said, all in there has to be just sauteed in very, very gently. It doesn't have to have any major thing in this here. After the onion and apple have wilted, add the red cabbage and red wine or water. <coughs> Mix it. And what you can do, some people like to put a little shot of red wine on it. If not, just put some, some, some water on it. After the cabbage has simmered 45 minutes, Chef Preuss grates a raw potato into the mixture to thicken. But what you do, and you got all that potato in, you gotta put it back onto the stove and let it cook. So the starch from the potato will thicken the cabbage up. The goose is boned and cut into serving pieces. Garnish includes sliced onion and apple from the cavity, red cabbage, and potato dumplings.